When felling a tree, I don't know why more people don't use excavators to uh, help protect from accidents. In this situation, I'm on the side of a hill and I'm in between a house and a garage and I've got a wild cherry tree that is uh, bent and twisted and leaning towards my neighbor's side. And recently I started noticing some uh, insect activity that took out the base and now it's no longer leafing. So I know that tree is short lived for this world. And uh, as we look up, it's a pretty big tree. It's um, about 45 feet of solid trunk and then you get into wispy stuff. And so what I've done is I've parked my excavator so that I can set up like so. And you can see I'm going to have to keep the tree from falling towards my neighbors once I cut into it. Um, what I normally do is I'll park opposite of where uh, I want it to fall and I'll put my cuts into my tree and then I'll just push it over with the excavator. But sometimes you don't get to that, have that option. So what you have to do is you have to put the excavator where you don't want it to go. And then you start making your cuts and you begin pushing. And then you move the tree into a spot where eventually gravity will do what it needs to do. Uh, I was able to drop that cherry tree. Um, gotta say it was not a comfortable thing to do. As you look up there, uh, these oaks, they uh, definitely had some branches that could have interfered with the fall of the tree. You know, I've got the uh, barn here on this side, got my neighbor's house right here, and uh, I was doing all of this on an embankment with a tree that was leaning backwards. How I used my excavator to apply pressure to the tree, um, I then went and made my cut line and uh, began to make the back cut uh, ever increasing the pressure from my excavator uh, slowly leaning the tree uh, to upright and then eventually was able to start to push it towards the direction that I wanted it to go and um, finish the fell uh, of the tree by actually snapping the tree using the pressure of the excavator and uh, fortunately it all went well but as you can see um, I didn't have a lot of room to play with so again excavators uh, really are an awesome thing at helping in so many different jobs